yeah, really happy, really happy. I thought we um, we picked up, you know, where we took off on Saturday. Actually, I thought, you know, obviously we disappointed to draw nil nil um, Saturday, but I thought the first half was probably the best we've played all season. So it was nice to, after you know, it being quite scrappy second half, to pick up where we left off on from the first half. So yeah, I thought it was a real dominant, um, controlling performance. And you were able to double the lead and also triple it for the first time this season. Must be pleased to find the yeah, again, you know, I've, I've been vocal about the fact that, you know, we're a new team, you know, there's, we need that cohesion. There's 10 new players and we're still not where we need to be, you know, the next game hopefully will be that even bet, that much better and the next game after that will be that much better. So, look, you know, I, I still feel like we haven't re reached our potential, you know, it's a great scoreline today, a really good performance, but I just know from this group there's a lot more to come again. Yeah, and we're fortunate, you know, we've got such a talented squad. You know, we've worked really hard in the summer around recruitment and making sure we've got the right people. And, um, you know, it's amazing because then, you know, we've brought people out who played on Saturday. Um, you know, I thought Cosmos was excellent on, on Saturday, you know, a real thorn in, in the opposition side. And he comes out today because he's a bit leggy and, you know, you get to put Tyler Little in and he performs really well and gets a goal. So, I'm, you know, over the moon for him, really proud of him. And, yeah, you know, thank God we're, we're, we're lucky. We've got an array of talent where when you've got two games in three days, you can... You know, really build on it and, and, and put in a performance like we've done. I'm still a beat at the start of the season. You're still pleased with the start and you're to continue that as well. Say again, sorry. So you're hoping to continue the unbeaten start? Yeah, yeah, of course. Yeah, I think. Um... That, that's always the aim, isn't it? You know, we've just been having a conversation off off camera about you know it's, there's a war in terms of the season and the battles of the game. So look, you know, we want to take each game as it comes, and of course, going unbeaten would be brilliant for as as long as we can. But we've just got to keep taking each game as it comes. I know it's a real cliche, but like, like I keep saying, you know, the next game hopefully will be an improvement on today, and so on and so forth. And we, we're just evolving as a group, and that's why I was really pleased with Saturday's performance in terms of the first half because. We for the, probably for the first time we managed to start doing what we wanted to do in possession, um, and then we carried that on a little bit more today. So yeah, ever evolving, always wanting to improve, of course. And um, you know, it's brilliant for me just to see my players getting on at each other at three 0 up and in the latter stages of the game, just trying to drive standards. So it's that elite mentality that, that we're looking for. Be tough again. I mean, you know, I've not looked at the results from today, but I can imagine they're all over the place again. You know, there's been. It's been so up and down, and it's because it's such quality in the league. You know, any team can beat anyone. So, you know, we, again, I bring that elite mentality into it. You know, we just got to constantly keep looking at the next game, being better than we were before, keep improving, keep getting this new group together. Don't get too ahead of ourselves after today. You know, we want to really keep the, the group together and improving, and take you know real courage and confidence from today. But ultimately, you know, it's about getting to that game and making sure that we uh, we're, we're at at the levels that we were today.